big. This is Darren Shapiro, 21 years old, and when you talk about a man dominating a sport, none has done that better than Darren. They call him the Scud. They do call him the Scud, but he hasn't been dominating to the same extent lately as he did a few years ago. Nice switch stance there, Rayleigh, into an air fake. He rolled the front. Ho oh, ho! Big, huge glide for Darren Shapiro. Now watch that freestyle clock in the left-hand corner. The riders have only 25 seconds to do five tricks. Darren, with five seconds left, backside Mobius, he nails it, and that's a 1,500-point trick. A great first pass for Darren Shapiro. In fact, 10,229 points on that first pass. He is looking at a new record, possibly, if he can do that again in his second pass. Look at how smooth that Mobius is. I mean, you have to do a flip and a helicopter at the same time, and Darren does it easily. Now, you might notice something a little bit unusual today, and what is that? Darren Shapiro is first off the dock because he fell yesterday and barely made it into the finals. But it doesn't seem like it's affecting him here, Dan. In fact, Darren is used to going out last, knowing what score he has to be. A little bit different scenario here, where now he has to set a score for everybody else to beat. And it's looking like he's setting a huge score. Fakey to fakey roll for Darren. He's got two tricks left. Whoa, he grabs that fakey roll to front. He's only got four seconds. An air method front flip, Darren Shapiro. This could be a world record. Throws in a hoochie glide there for good measure. And let's see what his total score is. He needs to beat 20,660 points to break his own world record. Nice grab there for Darren Shapiro. You know, he's using a little bit of a longer rope than he has in the past. Getting a little bit more air and extending his tricks a little bit further. Nice, big air method front flip. And Darren looks like he does it with ease. Well, the total on his second pass is 10,233 points for 20,462 points. He is just shy of his own world record, but sets a great ah, intensity. You're talking about this guy then, Jeff, here. This is his first Mastercraft pass, and the freestyle clock starts counting down. Jeff here starts heating up. Oh, he certainly does. Jeff Fear is from Canada, one of the few Canadians on tour. You know, the other Canadian, Jeremy Kobeck, is injured. Oh, I hope Jeff Fear didn't get injured right there. He goes down hard. Looks like he did a face plant. Let's see what happens. Got a nice hard carve into the wake there. And just kind of gets a little bit far forward and goes down. Well, that means that Jeff here has got a lot to make up then here on pass number two. Ooh, I mean, he got hammered there, only 4,000 points. I mean, but let's see what he can do. Maybe he can still get a second. You never know. Nice carve into the wake for Jeff here. An Air Rayleigh. You know, Dan, last year, every time we saw an Air Rayleigh, we were freaking out. Now every rider practically can do Air Rayleigh's. Well, there was his second trick, Tony. That's a fakey to fakey roll. That freestyle clock is already down to 10 seconds as Jeff goes for a backside method front flip. You know, he doesn't have enough time to do all his tricks. What's he gonna do? A switch stance Mobius. He skipped an air front flip and that switch stance Mobius looked a little bit off axis. Well, let's go ahead and take a look back. This is trick number three. That's a nice grab and big air on that backside method front flip. Now he's probably going, what am I gonna do? I only got four or five seconds left. He knows Darren's in the clubhouse with over 20,000 points kind of rushes into a switch stance Mobius, and I don't know if he's going to get credit. Well, we'll find out with the scores, and there it is, 8366 total for 12,389, and that's not going to overtake Darren Shapiro. We are back inside the Mastercraft, and being pulled behind it is Kobe Mikasich. Kobe is a relative newcomer as he gets over that chop heading into the course. Kobe moved to Orlando, and ever since he moved to Orlando, he's really improved. He has a little bit of a different style, stands very erect, and doesn't have the same type of style that a Byerly or a Gator does, but he certainly has been going huge. Starts off with the backside roll to Revert. Nice, fakey roll to front for Kobe. You know, he doesn't even look like he's in a contest. Looks like he's just going out there having fun riding behind that Mastercraft. Here's a fakey to fakey roll for Kobe. Really super smooth. Five seconds left. And air, fakie roll to front, ho! For Kobe's first appearance here at the Bud Pro Tour, that was a terrific pass.
Yeah, Kobe moved to Orlando from California, lived in Tahoe as well as some other areas. But as you said, ever since coming to the Sunshine State, he has been shining brightly out here on the tour, doing a great job here in Shreveport. Picks up 9,794 total points in his first pass. Pass number two is officially underway as the freestyle clock begins to count down. Started off with the backside air Rayleigh. Nice carve into the wake. He goes pretty big, does Kobe, on a front side roll. Front flip. Now, he doesn't grab that front flip. You know, he's going to lose a few style points for not grabbing that. And then a front side roll to Revert. He's only got five seconds left. Let's see what he can do here. The freestyle clock is counting down. <laughs> Boom! Backside Mobius right at the end of time. He doesn't make it. I don't know if he would have got credit if it was out of time or not, but still. That's Kobe's most difficult trick, a 1,500-point trick that he does not quite complete. Yeah, it looked like an edge just uh, got caught there. Came up a little bit short on the rotation. Boom, down he goes. Edge caught the wake, and he just couldn't pull it out. Only part of Gator's success puzzle, if you will, that is missing is the mental aspect. He's been lacking a strong mental approach toward this game. I know he's been seeing a sports psychologist. I think he's getting over that very quickly, and it's showing up now out here on the tour. Well, last year at the Worlds, he went off. He got first place in the expression session, which is what he likes to do, express himself out there on the water. Let's see how he does here. He's starting off really big. Beautiful grab there on that half-cap stalefish roll. Starts his trick right before wow. time runs out and nails it. I tapped him to Fanky. Ho, 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 doctor. Great first pass for Gator. Look at the height he gets, and he grabs that slob on that front flip a little bit differently than the other riders, and that'll get him some extra style points. Pass number two. Look at that. 9,807 points on that first pass. Still a little bit shy of Shapiro, but a great score nonetheless for Gator. He can still possibly beat Shapiro. Oh, my. That was the hugest slob front flip to Fakey I've ever seen. Then he goes for a switch stance roll. A nice air back to front roll. He's got one more trick left. A lot of time. He throws the Mobius. He nails it. Oh, my. And the crowd goes off as Gator does. This is the best I've ever seen Gator ride. Is it enough to overtake Shapiro? We'll have to check out what the judges think. All right, while we're waiting for the judges' score, Tony, let's take a look at this final trick. It's his Mobius. Gator gets a nice carve into the wake. Smooth handle pass, but he does get a little bit forward lean right there. Mobius is probably one of the most difficult picks out there, but Gator holds on for it. Any of which could overtake Darren Shapiro. Dean Lavelle is first, and we call him our 10 event skier. Well, I'll tell you what, Dan. We used to call him the 10 event skier, but now we call him an expert wakeboarder because Dean loved wakeboarding so much that he quit his job at SeaWorld to wakeboard full time. Yeah, he's still freestyle jumps. Yeah, he's still air chairs, but his focus is definitely wakeboarding, and it's showing in the way he's riding here today. Front flip right there with the method grab. He's got one more trick left, and it's an air front flip. He nails it. Great first pass for Dean. I mean, he's going to put some heat on both Gator and the Scud. Well, Tony, while we're waiting for the judges' scores, let's go ahead and take a look back at one more trick of Dean Lavelle's. This is a back-to-front roll. Look at the extension he gets. Keeps his legs really straight and lands way out in the flats. And so that first pass is worth 9,790 points. Boy, he's got a great run going right now. Dean Lavelle with an opportunity to overtake Shapiro. He's going to need about 10-4 or 10-5 on this pass. We'll see if he's got it in him today. Here's a back-to-front roll for Dean Lavelle. Puts the board into the fakey position. A fakey to fakey roll. Beautiful air back to front roll. That's an air back to front roll. A roll without a wake. And there's the Mobius. He nails it. Everybody's doing Mobius today. Dean Lavelle, is it enough to overtake Gator or Darren? I don't know, but I'll tell you what. It's going to be close. Nice fakey to fakey roll right there for Dean. And then, boom, throws it right into an air back to front roll and then look at this mobius have a pass a little late lands on his tail but holds on <laughs> dean lavelle coming to shore with 10,257 points 20,047 points for third place darren shapiro still our leader three guys with over 20,000 points though i tell you dean you always look like you're having a great time you look like you really had a good time out there today I swear there's thermals out there because, man, when I hit that wake up. Here comes Shannon, a competitor out here today. Shannon 
from Australia. Now you've heard about being on a walkabout. Well, Shannon Best is on a wakeabout. He's been going all over the place. He's been wakeboarding in California, in Texas. Now he lives in Florida, and he's having a great time on tour. He's always out there partying and living up to his Australian nature. Front flip for Shannon Best. He's got four seconds left. Can he make it here? He nailed his last trick, yes, and air back roll. Great opening pass for Shannon Best. You know, Tony, we are seeing some superb performances on the parts of everybody out here. Yeah, I mean, three guys over 20,000 points, 19,000 was the world record just a few months ago. I mean, it's incredible. And look at that. Shannon Best on his first pass picks up almost 10,000 points. He's got a chance here to get to 20,000. Air method front flip for Shannon. Look how determined he looks. Ho! Oh, and air mobius for Shannon Best. Ho, oh, doctor. He could put some heat on the scud. We'll see what happens here. He's got four seconds left. Front flip for Shannon. He nails it. What? Passes today here. Oh boy, the wakeboard is love street for Tony, you got me excited. I don't I can't remember when we have seen this many back-to-back -back unbelievable performances. Shannon Best, just the latest in a string of wakeboarders to wow the crowd. 10,043 points for Shannon Best. Almost gets to that 20,000.